they do, they do. So, Shahid, I'm going to ask you first. Um, what did you think of the entire collection? Well, first of all, it's amazing to be here, and it's great to walk with uh, Vani. Vani and me have done something for the first time together, so that's great. So it was a lot of fun walking with you, Vani. And, um, I mean, I've been a huge uh, Marks and Spencer fan. I've grown up watching their stuff, mostly in magazines. I've also been a customer. Uh, I've, I've brought this, I bought their stuff, and today I'm walking here, so I think it's a great privilege to be walking for such an iconic brand. I think the collection is great. I think the theme is, I think, uh, to rethink things, and uh, it's amazing that they've come up with a collection which encourages people who might be in a certain comfort zone, especially in their workspace, uh, to go out there and discover themselves. I think we're in a time today where it's important to express yourself, whether that's through your work or through your clothes. I'm in a profession where what I wear is, is a huge part of how I feel, and that directly um, you know, impacts the kind of work that I do because my headspace impacts that. So it's great they're encouraging people to do that. Um, I was told that they have uh, a lot of in-house stylists who, who are there to assist you whenever you go there. If you're not sure about what you want to do, they'll help you out with it. So I think that's great for customer care, and that's great for encouraging people who might not be that confident to eventually get to a point where they feel confident to express themselves. I think it's a great collection. It's really cool. You can wear it in all kinds of uh, situations. You can wear, wear it casually. You can wear it formally. And uh, I'm doing a little bit of both. So yeah, so I've had great fun. This is awesome. Vani, I have to say that that color was made for you, though. It is. It's looking absolutely gorgeous. And uh, you got to take a look as well at our new collection. So what did you think of it? Well, I think Shahid has summed up for everybody. Uh, I just like to say, uh, like he said, that it is uh, something that you've grown up, you know, the, the, the uh, brand in itself is so classy and chic, and we all have grown up uh, wearing their clothes. And it's only incorporated more style and evolved and um, created um, a different kind of, uh, y you know, they've added more quirk and cool to it. Um, in terms of animal prints and stripes and something that you can wear day to night, you know. Um, it is just, uh, it's only and only getting better. If you had to rethink something in your wardrobe, or when it comes to your style quotient, what would it be for you? Well, whatever they gave me to wear, they're not getting it back. I'm taking it home with me. So as far as rethinking is concerned, <laughs> I'm taking this home, guys. Deal with it. <laughs> and uh, Vani, what about you? Are you going to be rethinking anything in your uh, style wardrobe as well? Rethinking? I, I think I will be. Vani, I'm going to take your clothes as well. So. For Mira, I believe. I hope. I hope it's her, not for myself. <laughs> uh, I'll happily give. I, I think Marks and Spencers will happily give. Huh? If it's mine to give, I'll give it to you, happily. It's not yours to give, but I'm still taking it. Okay. <laughs> Backstitch. I, we gotta wait for that to happen. What was your question? <laughs> what did you want me to answer? What am I rethinking? I'm rethinking. So, so I, I believe that, um, you know what actually the brand has done is um, there are people who do not get, uh, who are maybe not sure, they're not certain, they are slightly oblivious sometimes uh, as to what they could, you know, do in, in the name of exper being experimental in their outfits. And, um, and that's when Marks and Spencer smoothly comes in with a stylist and becomes a second voice in their head and they, they help them out. Um, to rethink something that they might not have thought in the first place, and it, it would actually work really well for them. So, yeah. Okay, and I have one final question for both of you. Do you have one style tip for everyone out there for uh, their spring summer collection? <laughs> Go on Google search, <laughs> figure out where the closest Marks and Spencer store is, and go there. Any other search, search engine which you're aware of, Vani, which you'd like to say? As of now, Google, I believe. You could YouTube, you could, uh, I don't know, ask your Siri. They have an Apple map as well, so whichever one you prefer.
whichever one works, but we know that this collection definitely works. So once again, James and Francesca, could I please ask both of you to come and join us onto the stage for one final photo op. And ladies and gentlemen, we're so happy that you could come and join us and be a part of this very special showcase for us over here at Marks and Spencer. Thank you, thank you so much ladies and gentlemen. Vani, we'll be seeing you very soon. And Shahid, I'm gonna request you to please stay back because then we can have our uh, questions from our friends in the media as well for us to do Media Bytes. So we've already got your first set of instructions. Okay. <laughs> Are the paps happy now? Or should I come and sit on your lap? I thought you have zoom lenses. You can zoom in and click pictures, 4K pictures, so the details on my printed shirt can be viewed well. I'm done with you guys. It's about question and answers now. So now you can click awkward pictures with my mouth half open and weird postures, <laughs> which tend to you know, go more viral than the nicely posed ones. So. Any questions, guys, or you're so blown with the collection that we should come back tomorrow and do this? Anybody has any questions? My answers are ready, so I can just rant to them if nobody has any questions. Uh, good evening, Shahid. Hi, where are you? Where, uh, can you raise your hand up? Hey, what's up? How are you doing? Thank you. Uh, how was it today for you? Yeah, it was wonderful. Uh, how was it today for you is more important because I'm hoping I made an impact. Definitely. Thank uh, you. You are associating uh, with the Marks and Spencer for the first time? Yes, this is the first time I've done an event for them, and I feel very privileged to have that opportunity. Uh, what's your take on the collection? Uh, well, the collection's great. I actually really enjoyed it. I was backstage. They have some big screens out there, and I was enjoying what everybody was wearing. I'm uh, thoroughly enjoying what I'm wearing right now. Like I said, I'm going to take it home with me. So it was amazing. I, I think they've done a great job. And it's really cool of them to, um, I would say, add to something that they've already been doing. They're such an iconic brand. And for such a big brand to come up with a new theme is, is always uh, challenging because they have to surprise people in a good way. And I think they've totally done that. Who dictates your wardrobe? Who dictates my wardrobe? My mood dictates my wardrobe most of the times. Tonight, it's Marks and Spencer. Hi, Shahid Ji. Uh, hi. You know, uh, today is Rose Day. So uh, Sorry, what? Uh, Rose Day hai aaj. So, and so, you don't have Rose Day? No, no, no. So, you don't have Rose Day, but you don't Rose Day. No, no, no. Your heart is always on your sleeve. And, uh, Today, who have you given your heart to? Besides, Valentine's Day is coming, so do you have any specific planning from your side? Besides, there are 150 festivals in Hindustan. Everyone will take a bite from Hindustan. Besides, there are 150 festivals in Hindustan. Everyone will take a bite from Hindustan. This is Valentine an event for Marks and Spencer, and you can ask me questions specifically about that. Okay, ramp walk से पहले कुछ nervous होते हैं. I know हमने देखा बहुत ही. नहीं जी मैं I usually just enjoy walking and showcasing myself and being judged by millions of people. It's an amazingly happy feeling, and it makes me feel you know on top of the world. And yeah, I was born to do this, I guess. you don't have a mic. Uh, we are in an event where we're talking about clothes and clothing. What's your uh, most comfortable material, like linen, cotton, yeah. of Marks and Spencer that you feel comfortable in? So thanks for letting me know that I'm wearing linen and cotton. <laughs> that was a nice one. I appreciate it. So I really enjoyed linen on top and cotton, on, cotton below. You know, it's awesome. 
ओके शायद अगर जिस तरीके से हम जानते हैं कि आपको तो सभी लोग फॉलो करते हैं ऐसा कौन है जिसको आप फॉलो करते हैं जी मैं कुछ डेढ़ सौ लोगों को फॉलो करता हूं और अगर आप मेरे इंस्टाग्राम पेज पे जाएंगे या ट्विटर हैंडल पे जाएंगे तो जिनको भी मैं फॉलो करता हूं वहां यू नो पब्लिकली बात पता है कई बार हम पर्सनल रीजंस के लिए फॉलो करते हैं कई बार जनता देखेगी इसलिए फॉलो करते हैं मैं काफ़ी लोगों को फॉलो करता हूँ कोई स्पेसिफिक है जिनका नाम आप चाहते हैं मैं लूँ यस सर सर मुझे यहाँ फिल्मों के बारे में बात करने की बिल्कुल आ, मैं कबीर सिंह के बारे में तो बिल्कुल बात नहीं कर सकता और ये तो कह ही नहीं सकता कि 21 जून को रिलीज हो रही है शाहिद शाहिद हो गया मीशा की एक फोटो वायरल हो गई है जिसमें कलर हेयर किए गए हैं उसके बारे में क्या बोलेंगे वो बिल्कुल मार्क्स एंड स्पेंसर्स के कलर की थीम जो थी उनको हमने फॉलो किया है और बहुत प्लान करके वो फोटो डाली गई है शाहिद हो या इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू हाय यहाँ पर हो या जस्ट इन फ्रंट सर फ्रंट तो ये है अच्छा आप यहाँ हैं जी सर यो यो मैं अपना एंगल ले लेता हूँ आपके सर आज तो टूट पड़े हैं सब पर इट्स वेरी गुड मीडिया पे तो आई कैन सी दैट या आप खुशी से बोल रहे हैं दुख से बोल रहे हैं दोनों क्योंकि आप स्माइल तो कर रहे हैं लेकिन आपकी स्माइल में थोड़ा सा गुस्सा भी दिख रहा है मुझे एनीवे इट्स फॉर मीडिया ओनली यस सर सर लुकिंग परफेक्ट थैंक यू सो मच विद ऑल द व्हाटएवर यू हैव टेकन द हेयर स्टाइल योर बियर्ड एंड ऑल द न्यू लुक मार्क्स एंड स्पेंसर मार्क्स एंड स्पेंसर मार्क्स एंड स्पेंसर मार्क्स एंड स्पेंसर एंड मार्क्स एंड स्पेंसर बट व्हाट अबाउट व्हाट आवर इनसाइड मार्क्स एंड स्पेंसर सर सॉरी uh on marks and outside but outside. what about inside what are you wearing inside today because <laughs> if you're not ma- wearing marks and spencer they'll be escorting you out oh wow that's good so in fact they can put me to in marks and spencer prove it okay i'll do that <laughs> no no prove it show us what you're wearing inside <laughs> okay so tell me about your new look uh, um you yeah well i'm wearing uh marks and spencer and uh, i'm wearing uh, like a casual semi formal shirt which goes with formal pants and i'm wearing poppy shoes cuz they look nice and uh, i'm enjoying what i'm wearing very much uh shahid in which of your films you think uh, your look is the best and the worst because you are a style icon and people follow your fashion but according to you in which of your film you have looked your best and worst when it comes to fashion well worst there is a long list uh because i don't think i had any idea uh in the first 10 years especially of my career that's why they never asked me to walk for them before um <laughs> Uh, but honestly my looks in my films are not defined by what i like and what i don't like it's defined by the requirement of the character and the story and the filmmaker's uh vision of of how they would like me to look so i don't have any personal likes or dislikes wherever i feel i have got the character right or the silhouette right right i i have felt happy uh, in the recent past i was i was happy with uh, uh, how maybe say a padmavat was or even a rangoon was uh, or now kabir singh that i'm doing i think Yeah I'm 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 happy I guess that's why I'm wearing those clothes so yeah but my reasons are different it's it's not personal for me in movies at all Shahid uh, All right sorry Shahid. sir sorry Shahid. sir 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 from here uh that's just going to be the last question yeah so once you're done that will be the last question that we have enough time for thank Shahid, you Shahid uh, do you think uh, you have evolved uh, in your fashion sense uh, since you have started I hope I have because uh, when I look back uh, I it, it's not a very happy feeling I think I made many fashion mistakes and I guess when you made all possible mistakes when it comes to fashion you can't do anything but get it right so I guess I'm getting it right more often than I used to um but I think eventually uh, being fashion fashionable is about being comfortable with who you are I think what tends to happen is when you start off trying to understand the world of fashion you see a lot of people around you who you appreciate or um you know who are uh, fashion icons for you and you tend to try and copy them uh, but what works for them is not going to work for you uh, and the discovery eventually is to express yourself truly and being in the field of films um this is what we do we display what we stand for and clothes are a huge part of that so with time i have learned to express myself honestly and without fear and uh, i usually wear whatever i'm in the mood for and uh, yeah i carry it with uh the confidence that you should carry yourself with whenever you are representing yourself and that's it shahid apart from you all right so that's enough time sorry ma'am i know i know but shahid one last all one last question sorry. but that is the last <laughs> okay 
Otherwise, what will you do? You have, you have, uh, you're going to shoot us. I won't do anything. Shahid, uh, you're very witty and snarky today. Uh, but apart from you, today, <laughs> being the operative word. <laughs> Right. Uh, Shahid, apart from you, who do you think should rethink their wardrobe? Should rethink their wardrobe, apart from me. Apart so basically you're saying you two have to no, no, rethink I'm your saying wardrobe. I, you, I, your is a safe answer. <laughs> I don't want a safe answer. That's okay. what I'm saying, apart Who from I think should rethink their wardrobe? Anybody who doesn't wear Marks and Spencers needs to rethink their wardrobe, man. <laughs> That's it. Simple. All right. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for that. I'm still waiting for you to prove to us you're wearing Marks and Spencer inside. All the ladies are waiting, buddy. All right, Shahid, thank you. Thank you so much. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's uh, bring the lady of the hour back onto this stage. So can we please welcome once again, Vani. Vani. You and Shahid Kapoor. So this is, uh, like Shahid also said, we are doing something with the Marks and Spencer ke liye also. Uh, it's a big, uh, reputed brand, and you know, hum, um, uh, in fact, hum dono ne hi, um, while growing up and while, you know, I mean, uh, it's such a huge brand. So we've always uh, walked into their stores, and it's a great honor to be part of this uh, event tonight. Uh, but it was a great uh, walk with Shahid. And tell us a little about your beautiful attire. Aap, aapke attire ke baare mein thoda sa janna ah, to ye Marks and Spencer's ka attire hai, this, um, it's a pants suit, and it's um, it's from the new summer collection, 2019, and uh, it's available in every Marks and Spencer store. Um, this is also um, something that you could do day to night outfit, you know, like how I have right now teamed up with heels, but uh, you can team up with sneakers for a casual evening. So it's something that gives you a, a versatility to be able to wear it in many ways. Gentlemen in front over there. So my style statement, uh, you know, I always believe style is an extension to your personality and um, you express yourself the way you style yourself and the way you're feeling, you know, there are times when you're feeling all dainty and girly and lovely and there are times when you want to feel like a boss lady. So everything depends on the way uh, your, your outfit uh, kind of projects what you're feeling. Um, and I believe Marks and Spencer also believes in being keeping it classy and chic. Um, and right now they've incorporated and come up with this whole new cool, um, uh, you know, collection and line of uh, printed uh, animal prints and stripes and you know, a whole lot of new uh, quirk and coolness uh, quotient in their outfits. Uh, so it's um, it's basically for every mood. Whatever you're feeling, you can don it. Uh, good evening, uh, Vani. Hi. Uh, do you think uh, being uh, fashionable is important in for being an actress? No, it's not important for be for an actor to be fashionable. You can not be the most fashionable and yet be a brilliant actor. But yes, it does. Uh, you know, people do look up to you, and people do want to uh, take inspiration from your style. Um, but style is also something which is very individual and it's very subjective. Someone might like it. Someone might not like it. Um, but here's what happens with the Marks and Spencers because of your, the, the range that they offer. It can pretty much fit into everybody's style. Uh, do you think, you, do you get uh, bothered by different looks which you have to uh, cater to? Like uh, you're going out um, with the photographers being always chasing uh, the celebrities. Does this create a sense of pressure uh, to be always uh, come out uh, well looked upon? You'll feel the pressure only if you take the pressure. I don't take that pressure. I, I just uh, like wearing what I f feel like wearing, and and I'm out stepping and about, you know, in what gives me comfort and confidence. Thank you. You know, Vani ji, uh, romantic season start ho chuka hai. Uh, Valentine Day bhi aane wala hai, and. Uh, Mera koi plan nahi Valentine's. <laughs> koi nahi? Nahi. And. Aaj rose day hai to kuch. Mere ko kisi ne rose nahi diya. Aap kisi actor ko. I'm, I'm looking like a rose today in this outfit. Hmm, wo to hai. Lekin <laughs> kisi ko dena. That's compliments. Kisi so nobody ko, else is complimenting, huh? Kisi ko dena chayenge, kisi actor ko, aapke favorite actor? Uh, nahi, I don't do stuff like this. Okay. All right. So it, it would be great if we keep the questions just about Sorry, style, you know fashion, and question. Marks and Spencer. There's so many people who I take inspiration from. 
there's uh, Audrey Hepburn, there's uh, Rekha Ji, there is, uh, you know, every new girl right now, you know, Gigi Hadid or uh, Kendall Jenner, everybody. Yeah. One is up. You gotta keep it to Marks and Spencer's. Sorry. Another platform. I'll answer all of that. Yes, Hi, Vani. Uh, I had a question. Yeah. Oh, you want to put it. So, uh, what makes you reinvent style? I mean, being an actress, uh, you... I mean, of course, we have the pressure to uh, become a little different from the uh, masses, right? So what exactly makes you reinvent? I mean, what, wh what, is, what is that driving factor that re reinvents your style? Uh, well, the, like I said, I don't take too much pressure about me reinventing and trying to uh, stand out and be eccentric. It's something that I, it's as simple as you flipping through a magazine and liking something and being like, oh, this is something I would like to wear, you know? Uh, I just think like you. If there's something I like, I pick and I wear it and I enjoy it. But sir, that's not something, that's not a call I can take. And I can't even influence somebody in a film. You're playing a character, you're not playing yourself. <laughs> so that's a call that a costume stylist will take. I, I feel Marks and Spencer is big enough. I, they don't need my suggestions. They'll, they'll get Marks and Spencer on board on by themselves. All right, so that, uh, we're just going to do one more, which will be the last uh, question. Yeah, one last one question. Normally, it is being said that coat pant ke saath juta pehna jata hai. Aapne change lai, revolution lai, bade achi baat hai. Do you expect from Indian crowds ki aage ye click hoga ye? Ya nahi hoga? So I feel style evolve ho raha hai. And uh, nowadays, uh, people are so progressive. Women are progressive. And they like to experiment a little bit with their style. And, and it only gives you more options to be able to uh, make your look more interesting. So I guess you just get a range of, uh, you know, uh, a different range and you only get more versatile with your outfits and your styling and accessories. All right, thank you. Let's give Vani a big round of applause, everyone. Looking fabulous as ever. Okay, so we're just going to be doing a couple of one-on-ones that are going to take place. And uh, I think maybe the bar will be opening again for a little bit and for the party to continue. For Bollywood news update, please subscribe our YouTube channel Bollywood Dangle. And please don't forget to press bell icon.